Hello everyone! In this video, I'll be reacting to the official cover of Cat Kid Comic Club 3 on purpose and giving my thoughts on it. But make sure to stick around until the very end of the video because I'll be showing you some behind the scenes footage of the making of this book, right from Dave Pilkey's studio in Japan. If you love Dogman, subscribe to my channel and the Planet Pilkey YouTube channel and let's jump straight into it. Just recently, the official cover of Cat Kid Comic Club 3 on purpose has been revealed. And what an amazing surprise we got. If you haven't seen it yet, in my YouTube short, I drew the cover and then showed you the final design. This time, the cover is totally different. Unexpected and, of course, super cool. So, what makes this cover so different? Is it a surprising visitor from the Dogman series coming back? Some characters we have never seen before? The answer is... No! On the cover, we see some familiar faces with Lil Petey, Molly, Naomi, and another baby frog that's blue. And if you guess that we'll be seeing some familiar characters, I bet you'll never guess how they're represented. Now, no more talking, let's start enjoying. First, I'll show you the cover, but after that, I'll show you a glimpse at Dave Pilkey's studio and how he created the cover. Here is the beautiful cover! Who knew that Dave Pilkey would have decided to go with a clay design? How creative is that? I love everything about this cover, from the clay characters, to the cute background, to the origami tree. Also, On Purpose is a pretty cool name. Dave Pilkey made everything in this cover in his studio all the way over in Japan. And in this clip, you can see Mr. Pilkey making Lil Petey out of clay. Dave used clay and aluminum foil to create Lil Petey by hand. How cool is that? We can also see the early sketch of the cover on the side which is pretty cool. Also, check out the blue robot right here. Maybe this robot could be an all new character and on purpose. My guess is that this is a new character for Baby Frog Squad. There's so many different possibilities with this robot and I'm even more hyped now, but we can only wait and see. Dave Pilkey created the landscape for this cover by adding the grass and attaching the tree made of cardboard and wire. And for the tree's leaves, he used different colors of construction paper, which gave it all a really nice touch and a cool 3D effect. I'm really happy that Mr. Pilkey decided to make this cover out of clay because it's obvious that he has tons of skills and talent with this. After all, we did see Claymation Philly back in Brawl of the Wild, and everyone agrees that that looked epic. Well, it's obvious that Dave Pokey can add an extra while to just about anything he does. He has so many skills and it's great that he's showcasing them, this time as a skilled clay master. Let's just hope that he doesn't switch careers, but as long as he balances his writing, drawing, and clay art, we'll be just fine. All jokes aside, I think this is very inspirational to see, and now I'm even more excited to do some clay creations for myself. Dave seems to be living the dream life, doing what he loves while creating magic with his words and art. That's all for now, until next time, and remember that you always need to have a purpose in life, and one of them is to be kind. I don't know what this book will be about, but this cover definitely helps me be even more excited for the book. And I'd love to hear what you think, so if comments aren't disabled, rate this cover from 1 to 5 right down here. But unfortunately, if they are, just go to the community tab of my channel and check out the poll, and there you can vote. Since you stuck around until the very end of the video, now you can watch my drawing tutorial of the cover of Cat Kid Comic Club 3. And feel free to draw along too.